Hello guys and welcome back to Vertex Tag, a bot that I'm running for a year now. I wanted to do a nice anniversary video of the first uh, bot that didn't blow the account. And here we are literally, and uh, was it nine days ago? It has blown the account, as you can see, zero, zero, zero. So I'm gonna walk you through why it happened, uh, my analysis, what's next and what, uh, what are my plans? Because uh, I am still excited about about it i know no, it's not the time to say something like that but hear me out until the end hopefully it will all make sense so let's jump uh, quickly on my fx book or or let me just show you quickly here the history so uh, actually the lot size didn't go that high i'm testing I will be testing, I'll be jumping back on it with some different setting, different stuff. And, uh, you know, it can go higher than that in this case, but it didn't go that high. What I would say happened, you know, it's happened around the uh, the banking uh, crisis of Credit Suisse and, and all those SVB banks and all that stuff obviously affected heavily uh, Euro, USD especially. So that was the reason. And as I said, it was running very well indeed for a year and I did make more profit than enough and i can jump back into it uh, with the profits only but as you can see here i kept it around 50k and after now talking with the owners where he said you know the balance should be around 100k before he said 50k but you know i get his point the more the higher balance basically the uh the better so i had it around 50k and unfortunately it wasn't enough so what happened he was around 15th of uh, march as you can see uh this ones were the biggest losses here i had around 50 50k so it all wiped out so let's just jump to uh my fx book with this nice nice graph sliding all the way down uh, as i said uh, let me just run you through the numbers here deposited around 50k and the balance grew the highest was 135k so over 85 85 yeah about 80,000 let's call it profits i have withdrawn 116 yeah um, i think i withdrawn 80,000 as you are showing 116 i think i withdrawn 80,000 because as you can see you know i deposited 50 that the highest was 135 and i think i took out 80,000 not sure it's showing 116 here uh, but i remember it was 80k so i could jump back into it straight away you know with 50k or something i'm gonna jump back with 100k different settings uh, and maybe different pair not sure yet but i will keep you posted but as you can see you know it was going very well until it wasn't so that's how this kind of bots work uh, martingale risky stuff need to be careful but it was enough to you know take out the uh, deposit take out the profit so i'm still happy with it and this kind of situations this unpredictable uh, moments in the market in the news in the world happened the same with the when the war started a lot of people had you know huge huge problems a lot of blown accounts the same now you know suddenly some banks uh, went out of business obviously that shakes up the market pretty pretty heavily uh, and let's just jump here on the um, trading view so this was around this time on the 15th it wasn't you know a huge huge spike 1.86 percent let's call it two percent in seven hours uh, it was enough to blow the bot maybe uh, i'm not really sure maybe already had some orders if it would be completely clean no drawdown then uh, I, I believe it would might even survive i think it had some orders already loaded up and then and then obviously Obviously, that kind of drop, huge drop without without proper reversal. This is one hour chart. So as you can see, one, two, three, four, five, six, let's say seven hours almost going down without any any big reversal. Uh, so yeah, that was that was quite big and then only a reversal. So the, the only thing you have to understand here, if you had bigger balance, it would survive. I had 50, roughly 50K, not good. If you had 100K, you would survive and you would go out with the profits around here. It would just keep buying, keep buying, you know, Martingale because it wasn't that super huge move. It would keep buying.
bank and then your take profit would be maybe here maybe somewhere maybe somewhere a bit higher and it would come back end it up with profits clean up all the drawdown and close all the trades and you know start going again here so obviously very important uh, in this kind of bots balance is important that's why we have it on cents account where in cents account we have uh you know ten thousand is a uh, hundred dollars so in this case it was fifty thousand so it's five hundred dollars that was in the bot and a uh, hundred thousand recommended would be uh, would be one thousand real dollars so i'm gonna as i said jump back in maybe different pair maybe gold maybe something like that i'm i'm, I'm specializing in gold and that's helpful because what i want to say is there are certain rules that i uh, i will definitely follow right now uh, as you know obviously in this case the start lot is the same 0 0.01 the lowest possible uh, 100k recommended balance really guys you know it's better to start with something like that or go for demo if you want because otherwise you can get uh, this kind of moves and uh, it's gonna get into trouble and the other thing is what i'm doing personally which i highly recommend is keep an eye on something if something is going very bad try to analyze what's going on try to anticipate if there's huge news if something happens in the world like a bank collapse a war starting you know what i mean another covid uh something like that even if you're in a loss close the trades close everything i would also recommend close for the night uh if you don't have many trades close everything you know make some profits during the day when you can watch it when you can see what's going on when you're sleeping you know i i woke up a couple of times luckily mostly with demo accounts where it was wiped out you know different bots not not talking about this one different bots so i learned that you know i'm personally in a good time zone where i can cover london session new york session pretty decently and i'm focusing on those two and i would recommend uh, as well night time switch it off if you're playing especially real money because something can happen in another part of the world that could shake up the markets pretty heavily sometimes the asian session is going with huge spikes um, and you don't even know you can do anything about it and and then you wake up and the account is gone so uh, i am still gonna say guys this is my favorite bot i am focused on that i am testing and trying and and doing the best i can but uh, blowing the account is the same as when you trade manually and you have uh, uh, some bad trades you know you can you can also go really bad and then you you lose the money and with the bots is basically the idea is if you find a good period when when there is no huge spikes huge drops with some huge uh, ev events going on in the world then you'll be able to do enough money to uh, get to a hundred percent that you invested and take it out take it out put it on the side and leave it for uh, something like that happens then another one another one you know and at least you always have that money on the side to jump back in because uh you know this is passive income if you want passive income that you literally have to you know just check from time to time once an hour five minutes or something and you're still gonna make decent amount of money then why not you know give it a shot why not put some effort into it why not stick to some rules and this way you can really get to some decent results and then obviously and then obviously continue like that gain experience and maybe even start doing it full time and hopefully hopefully uh, spend more time so i'm sat down now with the with this bots all the time and i have really really some decent uh, successes now experiences and and i'm really like liking it it's just like a extra boost that helps you uh, make extra money and don't don't treat it as you know switch it on and just forget that it exists uh, stay stick with it you know analyze learn and hopefully hopefully make some money and make some decisions if something goes wrong so this is it guys uh, i'm coming back and i will let you know what's going on and what are my uh, future future hopefully results so thank you for watching